Hey, yo, what up? It's your boy, Hot Breath Boy Jiggy. How you doing? So recently, I just made a subtitle tool that makes it a lot faster to do subtitles in Premiere and After Effects 2. I had a few people from that video asking me how I did the subtitle zoom transition effect. First thing you do is drag and drop the transform effect onto your text. Click the transform effect and put the anchor point to the center of the text so it doesn't hop countries when you're trying to zoom in or out. Then put it in your text where you want it to be. Like everyone else, I like my text at the bottom. Keyframe the scale, go forward a few frames, and then put another keyframe. Then go back to the first keyframe and put the scale to zero. Right click the first keyframe and press easy in out. Do the same thing for the second keyframe except ease in. Click on the second keyframe and slide the bar out as far as you can, as straight as you can. There's no easy way to do this, just have Control Z on deck. Uncheck use composition shutter angle, then set it to 360. This is kind of like a juicy motion blur. You press play and you got exactly what you want, but Premiere has this bug where on frame one, it'll say scale zero, but it'll actually be scale 100. We're gonna select both of the keyframes and slide it back one frame. Now that we're done, right click the transform effect and click save as preset. Name it some garbage, set the type to anchor in point. Now you have a subtitle zoom transition that'll work on any text in Premiere. I hope you end up somehow conquering civilization with this and with that i'll see y'all later peace